Hi, my name's Nick Robinson. I'm going to show you how to make my gem flower. So I'm going to start with the green upwards. And we're going to put in two diagonals. Unfold and turn over. And now we fold in half. to fold half of the folded edge over to lie along the diagonal crease. So it's going to start at the centre and this edge is going to lie along the diagonal. We're going to do the same on the other side. Nice firm creases and unfold and we're going to make reverse folds using those creases we've just made. Pinch through, flatten in the centre, so the paper is reversed inside. We get to the same on the other side. So now we're going to unfold the paper, and turn it over to the white side, and have the creases we just made facing in this direction. To repeat, we're going to fold in half, then fold half of the folded edge over to the crease. Same on this other side. Then we're going to unfold and reverse in using these creases on both sides. creases at the same time. So the paper is like this. And this is the stem completed. I'm going to put this aside and now we're going to make the flower. We start with the coloured side upwards and we fold two diagonals. out, turn to the white side, and fold in half, side to opposite side. In both directions. Unfold. Now we're going to take one of the edges in to the centre crease, to a diagonal, but we're only going to crease as far as this diagonal. Unfold, and we're going to do the same on the opposite side. Crease in as far as here. Now repeat that on all the other sides. should have this kind of pattern. Now we're going to change this section of the diagonal into a valley on both sides. So just the outside, leaving the inside as a mountain. Same again, just that section and that section. Turn to the coloured side and we're going to do a similar process. We're going to take this mountain here and make it a valley. And the same in this direction. These creases just help the thing take shape. So there we have all the creases we need. And we're going to start putting them in. 
same time. And the center creases should allow you to pinch in this kind of shape. So this is the shape of the flower. It's a bit like a gem, a bit like a diamond. So here's the two halves, and basically this flap here is going to go into this pocket, and we're going to repeat that all the way around. So slide it in one, two, three, and four. First one's come out again, pop it back in there. Slide everything up nice and tight, and the tension of the paper should hold it in place. So here we have my gem flower. <laughs>